Here are the top six iOS automation tools you need to know for mobile testing. Number six, XC Test. For unit testing, you can use the framework called XC Test. XC Test is provided by Apple and has pretty good integration with the IDE for writing your test, running your test, and even doing TDD workflows. Now there is some confusion because if you performed any unit testing prior to iOS 6, you may have heard of a tool called OC Unit. OC Unit has been depreciated, and ever since Xcode 5, the recommended testing framework has been XC Test. 5. UI Automation For more typical functional tests or black box tests in which you're going to write code that simulates an end user navigating your app, there is UI Automation. UI Automation is provided by Apple and is the Apple sanctioned way of performing iOS functional testing. To use UI Automation, you need to use Instruments, which is one of the tools that comes with Xcode. One problem with using UI Automation is that the tests are written in JavaScript, where iOS code itself is written in Objective-C. This is problematic because if you're writing an app, you have to switch back and forth between Objective-C and JavaScript. So that can be annoying and it can really slow down your productivity. Also, UI Automation is pretty lightly documented, so if you have a problem using it, you're kind of left up to trial and error. 4. OC Mock I'm aware that many teams love and heavily use OC Mock. It's like a typical mock object framework, and it's really good for stubbing out and making mock objects of stuff like code that leverages in a remote API like a web service. It's also cool because you can also use it for code that relies on a UI being available, like UI objects that you can't easily instantiate yourself through unit test. 3. KIF KIF, keep it functional, is a good alternative to UI automation. I like to refer to it as UI Automation++. It's third party and it's open source. A couple of specific benefits KIF has over UI automation is that you are actually writing the test in Objective-C. So there's no learning curve or swapping languages between Objective-C and JavaScript like you have to do with UI automation. 2. FB Snapshot Test Case FB Snapshot Test Case was created and is maintained by Facebook. Its basic function is that it allows you to verify your UI code by doing visual diffs between saved screenshots. I think this is really cool and useful that's beyond the normal kind of simulated clicks and play you might get with UI automation or KIF. 1. Frank If you want to do end-to-end -end testing in iOS and wish you could use BDD or Cucumber, no worries. There's a tool called Frank. Frank allows you to create acceptance tests and requirements using Cucumber. Frank also gives you the ability to run your BDD test against your iOS application since it acts like an adapter that connects your app to Cucumber. So those are my top six iOS automation tools for mobile testing that you need to know. If you found this video helpful, go ahead and hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any new ones that I create every week. Also, share with your friends and help spread automation awesomeness. For even more test automation awesomeness, head on over to our website at joecolantonio.com and sign up for our weekly newsletter. I'm Joe, and my mission is to help you succeed with automation awesomeness. Cheers.